So what we call gene therapy is really putting a functional copy of that abnormal gene into the patient cells. You can either do this, what we call ex vivo, and that typically involves taking um, cells out of the patient, blood cells, actually blood stem cells, putting in the therapeutic gene and then putting those cells back into the patient. Um, the other approach is in vivo, and that, that's usually done with now with um, lentiviral vectors. Um, whereas the in vivo approach that we're focusing on uses adeno-associated virus or AAV. And there you, you take the modified virus encoding the therapeutic gene and inject it directly into the patient. Um, either systemically where it can go to the liver and many other uh, organs throughout the body and particularly muscles, that's a good way to get, systemic is a good way to get to muscles. For the central nervous system, you can inject directly into the cerebrospinal fluid um, to get throughout the brain. And for the eye, you can inject either under the retina or even into the, um, the vitreous of the eye itself to get to, to many different cells in the eye. Um, so it, it's basically directly injecting the, the AV into the person. But the principle is the same. You know, you got to get a working copy of this abnormal gene into the right cells. In practice, of course, it's a lot harder than that, but in principle, that's the idea. <music>